I threw on a sewing make and spent some time in Hollywood. I'm hanging out in Hollywood with my sewing make on. I have on a dress that I made a while ago. It's so comfortable, so fun to wear, and I just threw it on with some Converse because I'm doing a lot of walking. And I have another sewing make that I will share with you when I get back home. here at the Chinese theater where you can see the what would you call it the handprints and the footprints of different celebrities so this is really cool I'm trying to find somebody I might recognize okay here we go here's Michael Jackson And let me see who else I can spot. Let's see. Um, who else? Who else is over here? I saw Whoopi over here before. Whoopi Goldberg somewhere. There's a lot of people that I don't recognize. I'll just show you. Maybe you recognize some of these. else I recognize so this is his handwriting his handprint and his footprint Joanne Fabrics and I want to work on this jumpsuit for my next project and I want to make this view here with the pants so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to purchase this cotton fabric which I think is cute but because it's pants I always like to make a muslin so I'm gonna use this as like my muslin fabric and I'm gonna make view C and see how this turns out so hopefully i'll be showing this to you in this video in the meanwhile i'm just looking through the butterick patterns because they are on sale today i don't know if i'm gonna get any butterick patterns but if i get any i'll be sure to share with you the ones that i pick up so it took me forever in that store i could not figure out exactly what i wanted but i ended up just getting this cotton fabric and then I didn't pick up any Butterick patterns, but I did pick up Berta. And this is Berta 6148. And I like these pants right here. It does call for a very wide waistband. The waistband elastic is one and seven eighths of an inch. And I couldn't find that in the store, so I may have to order that online. I could always use two inches, but anyway, I like these pants and that's why I got this. So now I'm gonna go work on this jumpsuit. Okay, so I have all of my pieces cut out and I just decided to use some of these leftover scrap pieces for the front facing, the back facing, and these are gonna be used for the pockets.
so I am moving right along I think everything is coming out okay so far so I have the front and the backs put together I did put pockets in even though this is a muslin I just wanted to still put the pockets in there so that's how they're looking with the scrap fabric I started on the straps I just sewed them closed and then I'm gonna have to trim this and turn it over I like using this tool to turn straps and I will link it below if you're interested but you just slide the fabric onto this little tool and you close it and then you feed the fabric onto the other side of the little metal piece here and slide it over work it through and then it comes out on the other side and then at this point you can just pull the fabric off and it's turned here is the finished jumpsuit i ended up cutting an extra small there are back pockets side pockets there is a facing that goes around the upper opening edges of the jumpsuit. There are straps that tie into a bow. The sides of this jumpsuit are really low, so you will be exposed if you choose to wear it without anything under it. I decided not to put any back pockets on because I was using this as a test garment. There is top stitching that goes around the upper opening areas of the jumpsuit and that helps to keep the facings secure. This is a learn to sew pattern. The pattern instructs you to fold the hem up so that the wrong side of the fabric will be tacked in place, creating kind of like a folded cuff. I just decided on mine that I just wanted a traditional hem. Okay, so before I go, my love share. I recently learned about disposable urinal bags. So if you're stuck in traffic, if you're out camping or hiking somewhere and you really need to go potty, you can keep these bags in your car, in your purse, in your backpack. And when you need to use the restroom in an emergency situation, you can just go potty in one of these bags, seal the bag up and toss it in the trash can.